Princess Catherine's triumphant return to the spotlight has been highly anticipated after she completed her chemotherapy treatment, marking the end of a challenging health battle. With her recovery and renewed health, Catherine is preparing to gradually resume her royal duties in the final months of the year, including a few high-profile events. Many speculate that the princess will dazzle the world with her grace and resilience, as she has done before, particularly recalling her unforgettable appearance at the Bahamas reception in 2022. The Bahamas reception was a standout moment during the Platinum Jubilee tour, the final evening of the royal visit. Princess Catherine and Prince William attended the glittering event in Nassau, where Catherine captured hearts and headlines with her breathtaking style. For the occasion, she wore an ice blue satin gown by Philippa Lepley, a dress that perfectly captured the essence of real life royalty. The gown's structured silhouette and delicate fabric flowed effortlessly as she moved, evoking a modern day Cinderella with every step she took. The exquisite gown is by London based bridal designer Philippa Lepley. The princess wore a bespoke version of the Vienna crossover wedding gown. Eloquently draped, the gown features a crossover bodice, bounced at the top with thick straps, and a long skirt that flows down with subtle pleating at the hips. Catherine's choice of accessories further enhanced the ethereal vibe of her look. She brought back her beloved mother of pearl jewelry from Van Cleef and Arpels, which she had previously worn at Baftas in 2020. The elegant pieces, including a necklace and earrings, subtly complemented the gown's cool tone, adding a touch of timeless elegance to her ensemble. Matching earrings and necklace paired with a satin clutch from Lulu Guinness that serve a perfect backdrop for her engagement ring, the famous one worn by Prince William's late mother, Princess Diana. The mom of three is known for her sleek hair and she kept her signature hairstyle with a middle part and her hair tucked behind her ears. Truly embracing Cinderella, Catherine debuted a pair of sparkling shoes that stole the show, embellished with Swarovski crystals. These shoes were described by My Theresa as a true Cinderella shoe. Perfect for the fairy tale aesthetic Catherine effortlessly channeled that evening. Her dazzling footwear peeked out from beneath the satin hem, catching the light and adding a magical sparkle to her regal appearance. Catherine's appearance in the Bahamas wasn't just about fashion. It symbolized her poise and confidence as a leading figure in the modern monarchy. The event marked the end of her Platinum Jubilee tour celebrating Queen Elizabeth II's historic reign. For many, it was a reminder of how Catherine has seamlessly stepped into her royal role, combining her keen sense of style with a commitment to royal duty. As Catherine prepares to make her return to the royal stage following her successful cancer treatment, there is growing speculation about what her next high-profile appearance will look like. Her resilience and grace through a difficult period have inspired many, and fans are eager to see her once again in the spotlight. Some insiders have hinted that Catherine might make a stunning comeback at the Earth Shot Prize in Cape Town, a fitting opportunity for her to support Prince William while continuing her focus on environmental issues. With a series of key engagement lined up, including her beloved Together at Christmas event at Westminster Abbey in December, there is no doubt that Catherine's return to royal life will be one to watch. After months of rest and recovery, her presence is sure to be more captivating than ever, blending the strength of her personal journey with her well-established sense of royal duty and style. The ice blue satin gown she wore in the Bahamas may just be a glimpse of the extraordinary looks we can expect in months to come.